what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Malt. So happy to be here with you guys today as always. And we are still going through with this one uh, one unit elixir week, blah, 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 etc, etc. While I am off in Finland and today we are doing a whole bunch of goblins. This is not going to go well. <laughs> but we've got a lightning spell and four jump spells. Wizards are going to tear us apart, mortars are going to tear us apart, everything is going to tear us apart, but I think that it'll be fun and interesting to watch, especially now that I am only at 2157, we should be able to find a base that could be pretty cool. It might be sweet if we find a really lower level, like Town Hall 7 or something, uh, and the goblins just run around, get all the resources, and then destroy the base. That might be one of the bases that I'm looking for, but we'll see what happens. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and attack and see what we can find here and then I'll be back with you guys in just a couple of seconds uh, once I find a base that I think we can either get a good amount of loot from or that we can just totally annihilate all right so hold tight and I will be back with you guys in just a couple seconds all right guys so I think I'm gonna try this base as a town hall 8 uh, we can drop off a jump spell right here and we can drop off a jump spell right here. And I'm just going to start spreading out our goblins like crazy. There's a giant bomb right there that just took out a whole bunch of them. The mortar and the wizards are going to do a bunch of damage to them. But if we can spread them out enough, then we might be able to, I don't know, just <laughs> do something that I think is going to be pretty hilarious. Let's drop off the king and queen. Get them up in there as well. Uh, keep on spreading out the goblins as they get up in here and do work. He does have some clan castle troops, so I'm going to go ahead and drop that lightning spell that I brought with me, and that should take him out. Um, our king is being dumb. I really wanted him to try and jump inside the walls. So we've already got 28% of the base down. Uh, we've got goblins just running all over the place. Our king is outside being dumb. Our queen is, our queen is on the inside doing a good job. Um, watch this king do wicked damage to her. For some reason, lower level defensive heroes do a gnarly amount of damage to... Uh, attacking defenses. I'm going to use the King's ability right here, and if we can take out those clan castle troops, which we can. He just jumped over there. He's heading in there. I don't know what he's doing. He's chasing down those archers. Uh, I feel like there should be a range on that, but I don't know. Maybe not. 48%. Oh, no! No! <laughs> Alright, so we got 48%, guys. We didn't get a good amount of loot at all. But 48% with 240 goblins and our heroes isn't too bad. Alright, so... We're going to go ahead, um, I'm going to train the rest of these guys up, fill this all the way up with our goblins, and then we're going to be back in just a couple of seconds with you guys, ready to go, and <laughs> seeing how well this works. So hopefully this next time around, we can find a base that maybe has a little less uh, splash defense, maybe has some of it upgrading or something like that. So I'm going to train up... Uh, Let's do two jump spells this time, one heal spell, um, a freeze and a lightning. So we're going to get them in, hopefully, because that base really only needed two jump spells. So the heal will help them out. Um, we'll do that, and then I'll be back with you guys in just a couple seconds once we're ready to go. I've got a bunch of gold that I need to spend, same with that elixir. Uh, so yeah, but I'll be back with you guys in just a sec, all right? Alright guys, so I think I'm going to attack this one because it looks like his wizard towers are spread out a good amount. Um, so we're going to drop off one of our jump spells right here, and we're going to drop off the other one right here, and we are just going to go to town with our goblins all the way around the outside of the base. Um, he does have clan castle troops right over here again. I'm going to take those guys out. Uh, get them into the middle. There they go. They're running all around. Come on, guys. Drop off our king over there. Drop off our queen right over here. Finish dropping them off. Let's freeze uh, this mortar and this wizard tower over here. Let's heal up all these guys. Get them up into the center of the base. The king is working his way around the outside again. Uh, we've pretty much cleared out the entire center of the base. Hopefully the queen will run in and jump over the walls, but she's not going to. That is okay. Uh... <laughs> We cleaned out the middle portion of the base. Let's see if we can at least get 50% on this one. Once this king breaks this wall, I'll go ahead and use his ability. I, oh, I wasn't watching and my queen died. Dang it, she her ability is so much more important than the king's is. Freaking noob. All right, so I failed that one too. Obviously, guys, goblins is not 
the way to go when it comes to uh, one unit series because it will not work. It will not work that good at all. So uh, I guess this was more of just an amusing kind of test to see what we can do. We did get 62,000 gold, 53,000 uh, elixir, but obviously you guys don't don't try this at home because it's not going to work, all right? Um, I'm going to go ahead and figure out what one unit thing I'm going to do next. I guess it's going to be, um, let's do giant. So I'll go ahead and train that up and that'll be in another video. And uh, yeah, I'll be back with you guys very, very soon. So yeah, make sure you guys check out for tomorrow for another video. And as always, make sure you keep calm and you clash on for me, all right? I'll see you guys later. Peace.